Hi, it's Sunday, November 4th. I'm Kelly Nealon, and here's your daily briefing. With only 48 hours to go before Election Day, it turns out this election might get even more complicated. World famous astrologer Susan Miller says that Mercury will go into retrograde on Election Day for the first time since 2000, when Bush won the Electoral College despite losing the popular vote after a long, drawn out Supreme Court intervention. Miller warns that the public should buckle up for a similar situation Tuesday and beyond. Rebuilding in the aftermath of Hurricane Sandy continues. While power has been restored in some places, thousands remain in the dark. Meanwhile, help is arriving to relieve the gas shortages in the stricken area. Millions of gallons have arrived in the recently reopened New York Harbor. The Church of the Holy Sepulchre, built on the site where Jesus is said to have been crucified, is broke. Its bank account has been frozen due to an ongoing dispute with an Israeli water company. And the church, one of the most visited in the world, may close its doors for a day in protest. Czech archaeologists have discovered a 4,500-year-old tomb in Egypt. The tomb, the resting place of Princess Shirt Nemti of the 5th Dynasty, will need to undergo more excavation before it is open to the public. That's your daily briefing. Thanks for watching.